Loading tags. Uh, Revit will lo load certain tags already, such as drawings, sheets, walls, areas, doors, and windows. But it doesn't load everything. Uh, so you might have to load some tags. So to figure out what tags are loaded and what are not, we need to go up to our Annotate tab. We go over to our Tag panel. If we hit the down arrow on the bottom of the tag, we can go to Loaded Tags. We click on Loaded Tags, we get a dialog box. And this dialog box will show us all the tags that are loaded for in our particular file in a Revit project file. So we have walls, we have windows, and it shows the type of tag that's loaded. So we have the revision tags and we have a door tag, etc. But when I look, I see I have no furniture tags. So I can click in this area where furniture is, and I can say, all right, what do I want to do now? I can go up and click on load family, and then that'll bring me out to uh, my uh, US Imperial I can scroll down and look for the tags now the problem is where are the tags well the trick is they're under annotations so I go to annotations and now I have all kinds of tags so I want to go to the architectural annotations and here's all my annotations so I can go and select furniture and I can say open but I could actually say, well I'm here use the control key and I can add in a variety of things. So I can hold the control key down, now I pick casework. And so I can go in and pick specialty equipment. So I can load those three things at one time. And I'll say open. And now you see the casework has been installed and the furniture. Uh, likewise, maybe I didn't get furniture systems. Uh, so, uh, you know, that's another way I could uh, come in here and say, well, I really just want to load a whole bunch of them. Uh, and then you don't have to use them. That makes your file a little bit bigger, but sometimes more productive. I'm going to cancel out of this. And so I actually didn't, at this point, uh, load anything in. Another method you could do this is you can go over to tag by category. And when I tag by category and I select, select say, on a furniture, I select on a furniture that says, hey, you don't have that particular tag for furniture loaded yet. Do you want to load it? I'll say yes, and it'll go out to my US Imperial, and then I have to navigate to where my tags are, find my furniture tag, and I could add more if I want by holding the control key down, add in my casework, uh, for example, or my furniture systems, and I can say open and now it will load those tags in. It says someone cannot be loaded. Um, and I'll say yes. Um, actually, I'll cancel for that little error there. Uh, it likes one at a time in that method. Usually it's a little bug with AutoCAD. So in this case here, I'm going to click on this uh, uh, bed, uh, shaker bed, and I'll click on it and I just placed a furniture tag in there. And so at this point, uh, I can come over here and place another tag in for the table, etc. So loading tags, there's two different ways of doing it. Uh, I can come over to annotate, I can hit the down arrow, and I can go to loaded tags, or I could just tag by category. When I pick on something that doesn't have a tag loaded, It'll pop up with a dialog box saying, "Hey, it's not loaded. Do you want to? Uh, do you want to load one now?" And you would say yes.